We will be recreating this style right here from Grace at the Lupus. All the links of the assets I will be using is going to be in the description. The After Effects plugin we will be using is completely free for your first seven days. And then after your first seven days, or even when you're doing your seven days, if you refer three friends and they purchase it, purchase it, you will get it free for life. So might as well try it out at least, see if you like it or not. And it's so easy, I'll show you right now. Grayson Lupus has this nice shake effect that he uses in his video. So what I'm gonna do is you go up to your shake sauce right here, just click on it, go to your handheld shake, Make sure that the motion blur is on. Handheld shake, hit the check mark, boom. Now we have a handheld shake just like Grayson. Next, my boy is looking a little under color graded. So I'm just gonna search up one of my LUTs. Grab my LUT. Now he looks a lot better, more professional like the guy is. He first starts off by a really fast zoom in with a transition slash film burn transition that everyone uses. So just search up a film burn transition. You can find all over YouTube. It's easy. Or if you guys want mine, they're in the link in the description. And he just uses that and the zoom. So I've already dragged on one of my transitions. For the zoom, all you do is go up to this paper thing and click adjustment layer, hit okay. It's gonna pop up an adjustment layer. Bring it above everything, search up zoom smooth zoom in and now watch let's just bring this back a little bit so we can adjust it awesome now we're done with that now let's add his captions and that's also extremely easy too. go up to your text tab if you guys don't have the text tab just go up to window go all the way down hit text we're gonna hit create captions from transcription if you don't see that that's okay i'll teach you to hit this transcribe there should be a transcribe button up here click the transcribe button it's going to ask you just to transcribe it boom now you have the transcription hit captions again create transcription first slider bring it to nine to ten and all the rest of the sliders to the left single line hit create captions it's going to create your captions for you makes it the easiest process in the world Highlight all them by left clicking and dragging it. We're gonna go up to essential graphics. If you don't have essential graphics, windows, essential graphics under effects. Now let's just center them and make them right under our chin by hitting this zone just to get a roughly good size of where we're looking. Mine looks pretty well, but I'm just gonna do it just a little bit under it. He doesn't use a shadow, so we're not gonna use a shadow. And for the sake of this, er, and for the sake of my style, I'm gonna use my own font. And if you guys wanna know what my font is, use this monostrip. Just go black, up the size a little bit. And let's add, let's put some spice into the captions just to make them pop more and less boring. Highlight all of them, go up to captions or graphics and titles. Upgrade them to captions. This is gonna allow us to manipulate them just like you can with any type of graphic. And I wanna do that nice viral effect that you see everywhere. So I'm just gonna search up my viral effect. Viral text effect, let's add it to right here of these letters. Boom, now we have something like this. Awesome, now we have that nice sleazy kind of look now let's put the final touches on him what he does is he uses overlays to kind of emphasize words and make sure that the viewer is seeing something different than just his face so just go wherever uh, important key point is so for me it should be like solve i'm gonna grab my overlay and that same exact transition or a different transition if you want drag it right over it Awesome. Now just grab the same one, put it over here, cut it by using the razor tool, delete it. Boom. Now you are completely done. That's all he does.